Got Dan Combos. Got a cloud. Come on, say it ain't so. Say it ain't so, Dan. So Dan's selling Playing out cloud. to top tier over here. Yeah, he, you know, it's got to happen eventually. Yeah. We, all, we all want to win, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, we so all want to win. I know what it takes. I had this conversation about cloud and like, Certain characters Three, carry people, two, and it doesn't make one, you, it doesn't, it's go. not that it's bad, and you shouldn't think about it in a different way. It's just that if you played a different character, you wouldn't be as good. But that's just across the board, right? Yeah, and there's true. a lot of characters that you can be bad with and be better with. Yeah, but Cloud, but, Cloud is definitely but Cloud, the new version of pre-patch Bayo, where people feel like they've lost to the character, yes, yeah. Cloud, not so much to them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cloud's the skeleton key of, of skills. Like, you can just use it for to solve a lot of your problems. But dude, Bayo? Yo, Bayo? Don't sleep on Bayo, dude. She's still carrying people. No, she's, I wouldn't say she's carrying, but she is definitely top tier. Oh, we're, we're, we're seeing that limit beam take out Luma. Yeah. You know what? So Dan, Dan really wants to get in here. Uh, he's spamming four air a lot. I'd rather see neutral air and kind of see him get in there. But now that Luma's gone, he can use Cloud spacing to him. Oh, but he's back. Oh, he's be he does he does know that auto cancel there, almost getting that fair follow up. Could have been the stock right so there. I do want to see a back air or something to kill Luma rather than just trying he's to. He's hitting it with fair, man. Yeah. That's two. That's two. You got what you want. You asked and you got it, man. I'm asking, you shall receive. <laughs> oh, trying to get that dash attack, but he got called out. Oh, no, that force match. Unwarranted. Okay, Luma right back. Oh. oh, oh! that was so Sending strong. Sending Cloud to the stars, baby. That's Rosaluma, just that forward smash. Oh, oh and returns the favor. Whatever. Returns J the favor. Jason, oh, Tharts, Tharts, Tharts. Is it Jason or Tharts? I don't know, man. But I'm going to call him Jason because I can pronounce that a little bit easier. So good auto cancel down air. I like that Dan is <laughs> I do like that Dan isn't fast falling the down air. He recognizes that he needs the full hop in order to auto cancel. So kudos to him understanding the frame data on that. Back Great air. auto cancel back air. So most people don't know that Luma, most of Luma's, or not Luma, sorry, Rose's aerials auto cancel. Uh, and back air is one of the most deceiving. Yeah. Uh, and it looks like it has so much lag, and then she just whacks you right after. And, you know. And it, it, it does uh, the Luma cancel, too. There's the Luna land. Oh, that down smash. Great down smash to drag and, off the edge And there. where Rosalima won't do the move, but Luma will do the move. Oh, getting rid of Luma right there. Oh, it does not. I thought that, oh, that forward smash. Finally, there we go. Just <laughs> barely knocking her off stage. That did not care, dude. How many forward smashes? Dan do does gonna... not need another move. Forward smash is doing work right yo, now. Yo, someone 48% worth of forward smashes here. Someone tell Dan he can't throw forward smashes <laughs> out like that. He just did. Is Dan he? barely missing. Oh. oh, I think he's done. Yep, he's done. He is done. That's so, Rosa Luma taking out game one. Game one for Dan. I mean, not for Dan. My bad. You know, I wanted Dan to win so bad. But game one for Jay Shaw. Jay Shaw, very serious. Look at that face. He like, I took that game. And I'm going to go Luke. Look at that. Not, I not even that staying game. with the winning And I'm going to go Luke. That's, that's confidence, ladies and gentlemen. Here we go, going to Battlefield. Three, two, one, I don't know what you call Lucas' Uha combo. Is it called the Space Invader? Like, I don't know, the Space... Uh, is he going for the foot? Oh, no, footstool. Nah, we won't. I, don't I don't predict any footstool combos, but I do see an airplane coming. So Lucas's footstool is actually part of his bread and butters. So if you are a Lucas main, it is very crucial that you learn the down throw to footstool combos. Oh, he does not get a follow-up off of that spike, though. Looks good. See it? I don't like uh, the up throw or forward throw by Clouds. I really prefer the back throw because it always puts the enemy character out of position and allows your disjointed hitbox to just stuff their recoveries. Oh, he going for the finish. We just gonna do it, Dan. We just gonna do it. Dash attack almost knocking him out there, but good DI on Lucas. Uh, you know, to what you were saying, you know, if a character can't land, though, just throw him up in the air sometimes, man. And Lucas is one of those characters thrown Correct, down the but since timeline. he threw him up in the middle of the stage, Lucas now has the decision where to DI, on which platform, and if he wants to fall through a platform. Whereas if he would have back thrown him, Lucas is now stuck between the decision of landing on the initial platform on the left 
or grabbing the ledge. And Cloud's uh, option coverage just allows for, you know, just to stuff either of those options if you can read it. Whether it be a down air or neutral air to cover the edge or an up air to stop him from landing on the platform. Great down air to finish the stock. Yeah, auto shield, out of shield options. I can just kill you with there. Fishing for just kill attacks there, kill moves in neutral. That's, that's usually when you notice the player getting desperate. So. Jay Shaw, yeah, Jay Shaw using very defensive options. Every time Cloud makes an approach, he kind of rolls back or retreats with jump. But he doesn't. Oh, but the SD. You know, Dan, you can jump in melee too, man. This is a simple game. You don't have to learn. Dan, how we know to you, wave you whiff attacks, but you no don't need, need to, to perform Harikari. Yeah, yo. You can, you can fight with honor even after whiffing. Great. Oh, almost looking like a good combo there by Lucas. Misses the neutral air, unfortunately. Ah, I really want to see Jay Sean have a little more control on his attacks. It seems like he's just spamming at this point. And it almost worked out for him. Dan is just calling it so close. Yeah. Oh, man, he's getting wrecked. Oh, Dan also not taking the advantage of limit very often. Seems to spam the, the option as soon as he gets it instead of waiting to find it. He an seems opening. content spamming forward smash and then getting punished and getting... Up air. Oh, I didn't realize he needed to double jump for the up air. Yeah, there, he, he charges limit by by Whoa. doing forward smash and getting punished. And again, by with that, that very predictable and telegraphed neutral B with limit, it's, it's a good mix up, but only to catch air dodges and, you know, panicking situations. But the raw forward smash He's and neutral. Take that. That is He's taking it down. One, 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 one. And like I was saying, Dan's just content charging his limit <laughs> by getting punished. So there's no, you don't need, he doesn't need to charge it. He doesn't need to charge it. If you're going to get punished every time, then he's good. Forward Smash is winning the matchup right now. <laughs> but does Dan just keep throwing out for? Oh, yes. This is what we want to see. This is the Dan that we want to see. We want to see Captain Falcon. What a we time to be alive, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, a right spectacle here. Spectacle to see. At Fort Glory bonus round. This is what we want to see. Oh, what kind of message? What message do we got out to the fans at home, Dan? Team? Team? Give me Team Rhyme. Let's see it. Team, team Rhyme, Rhyme for Dan. Got Team Jesus for Jay Sean. Oh, snap. This is some, some foreshadowing for what's to come for that crew battle that's going down. If Both players on Team Rhyme, it seems. If you are not aware... Nobody representing Jesus, unfortunately. You know why? You know, I, I thought that Team Rhyme was stacked because on the Facebook page, it's all Team Rhyme. But, dude, Jesus, Team Jesus, that's the PR on their side, dude. The, P, the PR on Team Jesus is pretty stacked as well. So It is true, but Team Rhyme also has X. So. And it has me. <laughs> and it has X. <laughs> <laughs> You know what? Captain Falcon wins this matchup. I saw I saw Fatality play the buzz, and hands down. Yeah, I'm just excited to see some combos here. I want to see up airs and the knees and the Falcon punches. I want to see it all, baby. So there's so. this dynamic in Smash 4. Ah, very poor decision on the up smash there. I want to see him get rid of Luma. He's not dash attacking or back airing or any option that you would think to try and get rid of this Luma. He's more like just trying to get straight through to Rosa. Yeah. It's and not the way you want to play this matchup. Not... He wants Not to ideal. jab it out. You can gentleman jab it, wreck it, and he, Luma's out. He unfortunately up. keeps jump canceling his up airs as well. A little disappointing, so. Dan is like, wait, you can still control her. Yo, Icy just still in this game. Oh, yeah. So uh, something most people actually don't know is that even once Rosa is shield broken, Luma can actually still charge a smash attack. So... <laughs> So if you ever walk oh. up, oh, the raw knee to the face. You take that. Hell yeah. But I was going to say, uh, in this game, you can cancel your landing lag with hit frames. With hit frames. So what, you, what Captain Falcon can do. That's true, but only if it's not on shield. If you hit a shield, you cannot cancel the end lag. Okay, before, before you thart, before, before you thart my uh, uh, comment, let me finish it. So, okay, if he doesn't shield and if he lands, there's a lot of follow-ups for Captain Falcon to land if he can cancel his hit lag. Those confirms are legit. Yeah. 
Yeah, he does have amazing combo potential. And like any other confirmed, it does not confirm on Shield. And so thank you. Just, <laughs> just a heads up to all you, you Captain Falcon fans out there, or people who happen to just play against Captain Falcon all the time. Air dodges are your friend if you are playing Captain Falcon, and they are I'm like, yeah, I'm like, where are they? your I'm like, enemy if you are not playing Captain Falcon. Yeah, I'm like, wait. Once you get hit with a Captain Falcon move, just DI and jump. Never ever do you want to fear something. And in there dodge. it is, Dan what? combos taking down the T.O. battle. But Let's go, taking Dan. Taking it down. Let's go, Dan. Team Rhyme, 2-1 over Team Rhyme. Let's go. Shout out to Rhyme.